settling comfortably. And just establishing that perception of being both alone and also connected to everyone in this group. Recognizing the beauty of feeling that spiritual friendship even from afar, but it is something very real, very nourishing, which demands very little of you, just that you show up with or without your teddy bear. Whatever mood you're in, whatever thoughts are running through the mind, however your body feels, it's all welcome. We're not trying to change it, trying to argue with reality, but just learning to meet that reality with a very kind and gentle heart. So we've been practicing this way together now for about three months and uh, each week we bring up a different category of being so that we can really practice with all kinds of people to both widen our capacity for love and kindness and also to overcome any resentment or blockage, obstacle we may feel arising towards particular kinds of people. So today we're going to work with the so-called neutral person, a person who you don't have particularly strong feelings towards, either negative or positive. Perhaps someone you don't know very well at all. You maybe just see them around Don't give them much attention. So if it helps to just choose somebody that you're going to use for this person that you don't have strong feelings towards, you can do that now. Doesn't have to be fixed. You may change your mind later. Sometimes people just pop in to the meditation. When you've done this, just settling into your body, into the space. With a sense of welcoming any feelings, sensations, emotions or moods that may arise. with an attitude of loving awareness we'll just do a, a gentle body sweep starting at the tip of the toes today furthest place from your head away from the thinking mind into the feeling mind just experiencing any sensation in your toes Saying hello to your toes, how are you? Is there anything I can do to make you more comfortable and at ease? I notice my ankles are a little bit tight, 
tightly pressed together, so just giving them a bit of space. And allowing that kind awareness to spread through the feet, the ankles, and up through the whole body in your own time. As though there were a golden liquid flowing through your body, through every cell. Soothing, softening any experience, any clinging or aversion. And helping put your body at ease. If you find anything is trapped or feeling tight, maybe one of the buttocks is pressing a little too hard into the floor or the chair, allow yourself to adjust your body at this stage. So not only does it feel more comfortable, but your body also knows that you care. that you're listening deeply, kindly and respectfully. Allowing that golden liquid, maybe thick like honey, to smooth out any areas of tension, tightness. As though mentally mass massaging aches and pains away. And if you naturally want to spend a little longer with certain areas, maybe sensations in the shoulders, the back, the face, feel free to do that, whatever feels natural, without neglecting any little part.
so that the whole body has been welcomed into this space. You have a very clear sense of the whole body sitting. A little more relaxed and at ease. Noticing any residual holding, tightness, tension. And just seeing if you can take that relaxation a little bit deeper. Perhaps imagining it all just draining down through the ground held by the earth. Or maybe imagining yourself in a warm bath, just suspended and held by the water, weightless, light, and free. And now beginning to offer yourself thoughts, intentions, wishes of loving kindness. Connecting with your innermost intention, aspiration for yourself, for your own well-being and ease. Always staying connected to your own body. And if it's comfortable, to the area in the chest, the heart. Keeping the heart open and receptive so that each phrase can sink in, resonate deep in the mind, deep in the heart, as you just listen quietly with patience and warmth. in the space between each phrase.
If you find there's any obstacle, resistance, just see if you can gently open up, understanding you're offering yourself these little suggestions like gifts. And leaving the results to nature, to the Dhamma. None of your concern. What could be simpler than just wishing yourself well? And now with a smile, gently letting those phrases subside. Maintaining the goodwill to yourself, we're going to bring up the image or a sense of the presence of a very dear benefactor or friend, the loved person. Someone towards whom it's very easy to generate thoughts and wishes, perhaps feelings of loving kindness towards. It might be someone <clears throat> you don't have a very complicated relationship or intense relationship with. But maybe just someone who's always there for you. who brings a smile to your heart and mind to reflect on that, this person. <clears throat> you may be able to visualize them sitting in front of you. <clears throat> or perhaps recollect a time you were together, at years in one another's presence. safe, relaxed, and at peace. And allowing those thoughts and intentions of loving kindness to emanate from your heart and shower this loved person with blessings. Imagining them receiving those blessings. Relaxing their face, lighting up.
as you notice the effect in the heart area. You may notice as the meta flows from your heart to theirs, the mind becomes a little quieter. There may be less need for so many words. So just adjusting according to what feels helpful for you. Now with a smile, we're going to gently bid farewell to this dear person. And bring to mind a person who you don't have strong feelings towards, either of like or dislike. See if you can hold their presence in mind. The image may be a little more vague, but you can still get a sense of this person. And keeping connected with your own body and mind and heart. Gently offering this person the phrases, intentions and wishes of loving kindness. Recognizing they too want to be happy. You may not know about their struggles, their joys, but most likely they're very similar to us.
noticing if you need to adjust the effort or energy you put into the phrases. Perhaps refreshing the image or sense of that person a little more often. Once, <clears throat> once again, gently bidding farewell to this person. Perhaps notice, noticing a smile in their eyes. Staying connected with your own body. We're going to allow this metta to start spreading to all beings who are sitting here with us today. As though we were all sharing a beautiful meditation hall that spans across the whole earth, connecting us in the various countries where we come from. Holding us all in a field of loving kindness that we share. May we all be happy. Anxiety free. May we be healed. Live with kindness and ease. Just allowing that metta to keep on spreading. Showering each one of us with a feeling of warmth, 
protection, care and healing energy. Sensing that beautiful energy of loving kindness. Perhaps there's a golden light, or maybe a very soft feeling like cotton wool. Or perhaps tingling, subtle vibrations that emanate from your heart. However you experience that feeling of loving kindness, allowing it to start spreading beyond the perception of beings sitting together here, towards the front of your body, the forward direction, just flowing as far as it will. reaching all beings in the forward direction. All beings, human or non-human, visible or invisible, far or near. May all beings be happy, be peaceful, be liberated from all their suffering and fears. And this beautiful energy or light of loving kindness starts spreading from the front around to the right side. To all beings on your right. Human or non-human. Visible or invisible, far or near, this loving kindness spreads boundlessly, immeasurably, as far as it will to all beings on your right, showering them with wishes of loving kindness. alleviating their pain and suffering, even for a moment. May they all be happy, be peaceful, be liberated 
from all suffering and fear. And that metta keeps on spreading behind you in the backward direction to all beings who may be there, human or non-human, visible or invisible, far or near. May all beings behind me be happy, be peaceful, be liberated from all suffering and fear. And spreading outwards to the left side, reaching all beings on your left, wherever they may be. And allowing that metta to also move upward into the trees, spreading blessings of kindness to all beings in the upward direction. human or non-human, visible or invisible, far or near, may all beings above me be happy, be peaceful, be liberated from all suffering and fear. And likewise, in the downward direction, the loving kindness keeps spreading to all beings under the earth, spreading as far as it will. Until no part of this vast universe is untouched. Metta is spreading boundlessly in every direction without hostility, without ill will.
just resting in this space for a minute or two. Maintaining this sense of expansion. See if you can also notice yourself again sitting. Perhaps get a general impression of the body at the level of the skin. Noticing how that skin, the sensations in the skin connect you the atmosphere all around. And in the center of that experience is your own heart. The heart that you know so well. You know all the details of your own struggles successes, joy, and maybe shortcomings. So holding your own heart very tenderly, whilst keeping this sense of connection with all beings. I'm going to chant the final blessing to close the meditation. Sabe Sata Sabe Pana Sabe Buddha Sabe Pogala Sabe Atapawa Pavia Pana Saba itio Sabe Purisa Sabe Aria Sabe Anaria Sabe Dewa Sabe Manusa Sabe wini padika Awe ra hon tu Abya paja hon tu Ani ga hon tu Suki atanam Duka munjantu Yadalada sampatito Maui gachantu Kamasaka Sadu 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 Ha, 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 ha.